Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at TheGuardian.com. They got an article, Do Cows Get Seasick? Rotterdam's building a floating dairy farm. It is going to be a closed loop system. Cows up top with their feed stock. And then below, they're going to be growing some other feed stock under artificial lights like alfalfa. They're going to use the waste from the cows that are standing on these platforms that allow the, the waste, the urine, and the feces to just pass through. And a robot will also clean up any residual feces. The thing's going to be built mostly out of concrete, which you might not think floats, but if they design it right, it can be lightweight and buoyant enough to float. They're also going to have solar panels and, they say, artificial trees with real ivy to provide some shade. There's going to be basically an artificial pasture. They will also have a ramp to move along. We're going to go to the developer's website, Belladon. They specialize in building floating well, developments, hotels and whatnot. This floating farm's just the next evolution. You can see a little ramp here for the cows to get to some real grass if they so preferred. There are some critics that think they all might stand to one side and it could tip over a little bit. I think that can be uh, arranged. It looks like most of the cows are relegated to the center of it, not to the outside rim. That's going to help. But also, they talk about why not build this thing on real farms on the land to serve as an example. Well, Belladon, they build floating structures. Of course, they're going to have, a, if they build a farm, it's going to be floating. Well, you know, that's it for this story. You can see the links to these two pages in the, li in the description below. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.